We begin by turning on our calculator. We are creating videos for various pages at our site. This page will have a video for it. There will be a link at the top of the page right here that will go to um, the info pages where there will be embedded videos for YouTube or there will be a direct link to the YouTube video. On this page, we have four different areas. The what happening area, which tells us uh, about how this site is constructed. If we click on this link, we will be able to look at how to navigate uh, through this site. At the present time, you probably just want to glance over this and come back to it after you get familiar with your calculator. The next link is, is if you need to get an algebraic graphing calculator. The calculator is available in the hardware platform, but it's also available for Android and for Apple and for Windows. In the Android, Apple, and Windows version, there are two versions. One is the light or free version, which does not allow you to use the programming function of the calculator. The other version is the pro version. Down here, you will find links to the, those. There is also an emulator of the calculator with all the features of the calculator built into it. And there is a link for that particular one also. The next area is add a virtual algebra tutor. This area, we take our book that we have written for the Kindle and iBook and up various platforms, and we put the pages of the book out here at this site that we find will be useful for you. This site is free and um, contains a lot of information on how to use the calculator in an algebra course. The last section is calculator for your future math needs. Okay, we have put links up here for trigonometry, for finite math, and for calculus. These links show you how you can use even the free calculator to do various sophisticated uh, operations uh, on your calculator. The geometry link here will require the more um, sophisticated pro version or the, the virtual version or the physical calculator. So when you click on this link, it talks about how this calculator can be used for your future needs. You will not need to pick up another calculator. This calculator will work for your coursework and work for you after you get out of school. Your next step is to learn how your calculator works. These instructions apply to the hardware calculator, the calculator app for Apple iOS, or the um, calculator app for Android, plus the virtual calculator for Windows or for Mac. What you will do is click on the HP Prime icon, then this will take you to the HP Prime page. The HP Prime page is composed of three sections, generality, sections, and examples. On on this page here, you will follow the generalities sections and example pages to learn how your calculator works. Thank you.